a student athlete at LSUE is in jail tonight, facing charges of battery of a police officer, disturbing the peace, and resisting arrest. Stephen Molina is hospitalized in Alexandria after an incident in on-campus apartments over the weekend. He's an international student who played basketball for the team, but he's no longer listed on the site. Tonight, we know that as we first told you Wednesday, Eunice police were initially called to handle a fight at the Bengal Village Apartments. Molina was taken into custody and while on campus, we were told by students this wasn't the first incident, incident like this concerning the athlete. So our investigative team looked into the claim. We discovered the basketball coach called police the morning of the fight, saying he and other students were concerned about Molina's behavior. According to his report, one Eunice police officer said Molina looked spaced out and he admitted to smoking, smoking something the day before and not feeling right since. Melina's girlfriend was also interviewed. She said he was acting extremely erratic, and at one point she said he told her there was a demon inside of her before hitting and shaking her. Police say she had a minor scratch on her thigh and neck. Both the coach and girlfriend say this was not typical behavior. After he was brought to the station, police wrote in their report they felt Melina was under the influence and did not intentionally cause harm, so no charges would be filed. This happened Saturday afternoon. By 1 a.m., Eunice police were called out again. Armand Boy joins us outside the Acadia Parish Jail where Melina is being held tonight without bond. Iman. Marcel, the university has not provided any public records that we have requested on this incident, but Eunice police have, and they say they were, some of their officers were injured as they were responding to a fight that broke out on campus. In one officer's report, he says when he arrived, two people were still fighting, and one was completely naked. After he pulled off one person, the officer says Melina charged at him and punched the eyeglasses off his face. While calling for backup, Melina reportedly punched him several more times on the side of his head. The officer was able to pull out his taser, and after he did, he said Melina kept telling him to shoot him. Now, other officers were able to step in and assist and uh, put Melina in custody. He was hospitalized, and Melina was brought here at the Acadia Parish Jail for booking at about 2 p.m. this afternoon, and we are told that he will not be returning to campus. In Acadia Parish, Iman Boyd, KGC, TV3.